And I see your world guild battle defense teams. It's all LDs, bro. <laughs> I got through as many LDs at it as I could. Okay, Arena Rush it is. Into Server Rush, dropped a few points just now. Got a few new offenses as well. Got a few common offenses too, but we're definitely gonna see some of the ones I've never used before. Because I think this one is pretty dope. I actually build a few variations on it even. Wait, let's actually see how many hits for offense and defense we're at. We're 99 and 148. Help me build some teams after. Uh, probably not. <laughs> if you want it as a service, you can DM me on Discord. That is an option. Or you just join my Discord and you ask someone in Discord over there. That is for free, of course. Yeah, I tried Amber last week. It was actually pretty nice. Oh, freaking bot is not working. Yeah, let's do that while multitasking uh, hits in. why it's sometimes disconnected. I think I'd see one in arena but my fast set is 180. Kinda depends on the units and how you run them uh, rather than how fast your fastest set is I think. Like C1 arena you can definitely deal with just bruisering. I'm thinking about doing rush on my alt next week. Well, I need to do like a proper rune up on that account uh, tomorrow. Probably will do it on stream. Inter I don't really want to do Inter Server on that account, in all honesty. Plus, I would have to do like a proper uh, room cleaning, room upping, pre room removal, that kind of stuff. Like, I still have the pre room removal ticket on that account, from the, uh, which you get from the start. It has a lot of upgrades. Do you have Hanwolf? Nope. Mm, you can pair it with Riley as well. A lot of weird defenses. Not that my defense is that great right now. Kind of stall ish, but it's not really scary. If you had Lucifer, it would make Rush a lot easier. I think my offenses are fine. It's more that I need like something good for defense. Yeah, 
like even this wait look at this one so this is one of the new teams that i crafted and this one is actually kind of funny so you have the double sonia in here i should have actually used a different version but you can do this and then this and then half the team is that but i actually clicked on the wrong one Uh, in the end, it's kind of fast, anyways. If that actually lands. I have a fast way for this. I don't really think that the T Bunny is any good for uh, PV. Could I do this team? Yeah, I think I can do this as well. Like this is the other variant. Okay, that actually does cut in. Interesting. Didn't uh, expect that. Um, in that case, just since you already moved, there's actually too many debuffs for you to hit properly, anyways. And then you can reset it. And you can boost again. And he still doesn't have any skills. And there you go, and there you go again. <laughs> this is stupid, right? <laughs> like, sure, you need two Sonyas, but it is pretty stupid, right? It's kind of funny. Kind of stupid. <laughs> Looks funny, right? Something I was thinking about, like, a Sonya offense, because the pure vanilla cookie is buffed right now, and we're like. Wait, it gives immunity attack buff speed buff. That's like super gangster to just double Sonya at. Thing is, you're kind of limited to fire units, or n like not being able to hit fire units. Better said. And that's the thing, Camilla's don't win Amber. Unless they freeze Camilla, or the, the Amber like 16 times. Only limited factor in some of Zara's runes. No, I actually tried to hit some uh, fire units with it. It was not a great success. Like hitting this with it, I don't think you're gonna do uh, gonna do that well. So you need like a different uh, offense to actually do something like this. Well, it's not that you need the double uh, Sonya. You can technically use uh, like a Bastion or something like that. It has good base stats as well. Mm, that thing might be fast. The Amber and Nafti's aren't really that tanky, but I think teams like this I can still hit this way. The kinky armor breaking this is kind of annoying though, because that's pretty much like insta killing it. Oh, that's stunner though. Don't proc, thank you. Yeah, and then if Tiana goes, it's still fine. Did I see a double Sonya offense? Correct. I think is Amdwats kind of struggle with that many buffs anyways. Okay, so you still have both buffs. Okay, don't repeat you.
Oh, defense buff. Didn't think about that one for a second. You might be able to survive that right now. Deck increasing the pack artifacts. Wait, unless this is like a switch for calm. What's a switch for calm? Good thing I didn't just check it on Tiana. You replace him for second Sonia. Uh, yeah, Bethany. Oh, wow. I created both? Really? Pretty. I need a heal buff to stick. Okay. Well, it would be nice if they don't proc though. I already hear your title. Ah, yeah, double Sonya. That's definitely going to be in the title. In the server rush, double Sonya. Something like that. But you go for the typical dad joke, what's better than one Sonya, two Sonyas. At least that's the joke my dad used to make. I'm not sure if that's a typical dad joke. <laughs> Double fisting arena. Yeah, I might get shout bad for that one. Okay, and we're gonna find some hits. The defense isn't really rocking. I don't think I can really outspeed that. Maybe I should try some health as lead once again as well. This one I would just have like kill myself with other team. Okay, you don't have okay, you still have attack buff, yeah, you don't have speed buff. so easily of course Kabila would be strange if my Kabila does not speed that look at those LDs look at those LDs what you gonna do with those LDs boys even this one took Pretty gangster, right? Hmm. Thing is, would I outspeed this? Thing is, if they go super fast on DC, he would actually outspeed me. Yeah, I think this is not a good team against this. Oh, it's actually super slow.
He probably should have passed once. Should have done more damage. I think you can even hit this with it. Wait, let's rephrase that, I'm pretty sure you can. Oh wait, I'm not sure how much damage this thing is gonna do right now. Yeah, it might actually fuck me up. If it went S2, it would have actually done a lot of fucking damage. Don't think I should hit that. Jesus. Apparently it's pretty active here. Let's give people a taste of this, I guess. Should be very easy. No, well, let's just still go this. I can actually do this even. I don't even think it matters to go attack lead. Like speed lead is pretty much just as good. Aim for legends. Mm, don't think I have good enough defense to go for legends. This should be pretty easy with this as well, doesn't it? Mm, this one I might want to do this way actually. Yes, crit right there, uh, Sonyas. You don't need crit damage in Sonya. Oh, jeez, that thing stank as fuck. Happens in 40 minutes and rush. Okay, I did get a few defense successes on that switch. Oh wow. Interesting widget, that good. Rakam, interesting defense. 
sure interesting difference. I think you are probably most annoying. I mean, that is annoying too. I think I still have to do it. In this case, we actually go for this. Snipe on you. Make right piece. Yeah, good use of uh, Bethany in there as well. It's totally true. Mm, this is fairly doable too. Just snipe this, this. These two shouldn't do too much. Well, you can put Bethany. Bethany has a uh, high base speed uh, as well. But Bethany, you need to make sure you have enough buffs. The only thing. I feel like they aren't all hittable with the net these teams. I don't like to hit bounces, at least not like that. Mm, for this, I think you are slightly too slow. I could do this. Could give this a try. It's too bad that uh, Miang doesn't have the speed lead in Arena. Would have been very nice. Not sure which one of the two are actually used slow, so let's just fuck up this thing. That Sonya has great speed scaling damage. That is the main thing why Sonya is so good for this. Are you using the for defense? No, it doesn't really work. I've seen quite some people try it in the past. In that though. Could have killed over there actually. Oh well, let's just get this. Almost. Mm 
I think I should just kill this one first. Okay, you're gonna switch target right now. That's pretty bad. Not as in we're gonna lose bad, but it's pretty... Making things take longer, bad. It's good for attack well. Okay. Minus win to this. Ooh, complies pretty high up. Bad, bad. This thing is that fast though. Issue is that first unit I kill will be revived. It's a little bit more annoying. I think it is doable, it's just a little bit more annoying. Same for this, now this is actually easy with this. Maybe that you outspeed enough this though, which is a little bit annoying. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, the thing is, if he's silenced, he will just go as one Kabila, which I really don't care about. I don't want to care about if you provoke or if you go six times. Is everything proking today? Contacts. Hmm, could I outspeed this? This is tricky though, it's kind of on edge. Why well, has 9 on uh, lead, I have 7 on base. Thank you, uh, for sure. Using what about the angel again? Yes, using both battle angels actually. You guys tell me which of the two is the better battle angel. Well, technically, I use three, but. The double Sonya is very dope, though. Pretty sure I could clear out this as well, but the issue is if it procs and I don't kill enough, then 
it will be an issue situation. Lair, yeah, that's an option too to add into it. Yeah, you can do double Bethany, but, uh, it works too. What do you think of Light Ivor and Amdo at defense? I think that's super nasty. But... Is it that good? I'm not sure, I haven't seen any Light Ivors on defense actually. I think I would probably skip it at first, yeah. Because I'm not entirely sure about it. Uh, it's actually pretty cool too. Yeah, ah, Swift, you only grab some undergrowth. These kind of teams are so fun to hit with this. Like this is the kind of stuff you don't really want to armor break. And I don't think you would actually clear it with Lucians. Yeah, they're all anti-wind uh, uh, damage uh, kind of stuff. But yeah, anti-wind uh, damage is fun, but you ain't surviving 77k's, bro. Is there any uh, replacement for Nafties? No, I would use different teams if I uh, if I didn't have a Nafties, I would just probably go for like Oliver slash the map and then Triton and then Recar or something. Like you get your debts elsewhere, or your debuffs elsewhere. Actually, for how much I use the other team right now, I might give it a uh, thing to. My dream is actually going pretty hard with that budget defense. I kind of like the deep protection. Well, I might give better runes to the cookie next time because uh, the cookie is actually kind of fun. I could clear that with the other team, but it is somewhat tricky. Wait, I missed silence on that one. Should he first it would be Gemini? And yeah, I wouldn't really Gemini, it's too little debuffs. I would just get the debuffs elsewhere. Well, the thing is that Amber doesn't need as many debuffs to go for max damage right now. Because that was buffed with the uh, last patch as well. Um, I think I'll just go for this. I've got no buffs anyways, I'm not really fearing in that piece. Would I run this defense if I had it? Probably not even.
Do you have fire amber? Uh, yes, I do. Don't have it skilled up there. Just take those goddamn debuffs. Drifting crit rate sucks, man. If you actually have 50, how did you not land with 50? Well, not that I wanted it at that point, but... Multi-hit 50 doesn't land. And multi-hit 15 does land. How much mana do you have? Uh, 4 bill or so. Kinda depends how much artifacts uh, spamming I do. And then artifacts like the re-enchant spamming, I mean. with Pontus. Pontus is annoying by itself. I think that is a decent good defense here. Pontus brings in the Pontus lock and that's already enough. Just make sure your Pontus is vile. You need it for the random RNG wins. By 900 rests. Yeah, exactly. Something like that. Hmm. Don't like that poem with proc potential. Doable? Yeah, it's doable. Could be a little bit annoying, but I think we're good. I just throw both at this one, like one or the two will probably crit. Hmm. Would I outspeed this? Yes. Would I kill myself on that thing? Probably also yes. Don't like that part about it. Hmm. I don't want to give this a test. Maybe I should test it like this. Very bombable team, by the way. I think this does not much against me. Hmm. 
pretty blessed to not seems. Cabela plus two twenty five, maybe. This song goes a little bit uh, too long for that. CD doesn't work on Amber. Uh, you kind of want low crit rate anyways for hitting uh, these kind of stupid things. I think he's swift on those two units. Mm, that is annoying. Fairly annoying actually. Because of the speed buff there's no guaranteed crit on this. Uh, am I going to lose this? No, I still don't think so. It's just going to be annoying. He keeps proking, maybe. Galen, Tiana, Amber for slower teams. I would run some damage dealer then if you have that kind of team already that it's slow pace. Just put a Poseidon in there, you're good. Wait, no silence? Stupid as NFTs, you suck. Going up and down in points at the moment. We'll see. Oh shit, this dark desert warrior Bayek. Only LD5. He's not that bad. Don't really like him because of his RNG factor, but it's not the worst. Is that Swifty on Lang? Oh. Swifty on Lang has good AI, it seems. Freaking 100 <laughs> 15 crit raiders.
Only slight issue is that this thing decides to always throw back on you, and with that, it could be that it throws back armor break and therefore always starts hitting this. So, therefore, Triton is actually the first kill in the. Charge, yeah, not bad. And maybe that with a Vanessa lead and then double Camilla. I don't have Vanessa room up, do I? No, I don't think so. It's actually a uh, defense that I kind of like as well. Amber damage, does it get half on? Uh, uh, yeah, I do think so. I'm not 100% sure actually. All I know is it does damage. And we're missing freaking silence again. Fucking shit unit. Why does Nefties decide to be such a shit unit? Oh. Uh, wish we would have killed that. I guess we're kind of fine still. Good thing is that Kabila still does a lot of damage. It's also kind of built for that reason. to what extent I can actually one shot the king. Maybe we should have tried it anyways. Yeah, that's fine. Nearly one shot without without the oblivion. Staying low team, if you can 25 25. 25 25 is actually not that hard. I'm not sure if this thing is gonna cut. I think it didn't. The thing is on low HP is gonna holy light. Like he has good AI for doing holy light actually. If I wouldn't land a silence on Sorath on my But doing 25-25 on inter server is actually very easy, it just takes time. Is that safe G3? I think it's on edge.
I can't bruise some cleaves. You just build like the track of windy uh, something. Tetra, those kind of units definitely help. I think it did check the... Wow, we critted both? How the hell did you crit both? Good thing that the right one didn't crit. <laughs> Wait, full 50% that didn't crit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not sure how high the number one, two, three are up. I haven't seen them in a while. Probably Dream's still very high up. Yeah, I'm just really not sure like how much I kill myself for hitting this thing with that. We're gonna give it a try. Thing might be pretty bad. Well, maybe we just hope that it switches. Like that's always an option. Just wait until it switches. Or wait, we can actually just do this. What the fuck am I an idiot? Fuck you. No one gives a shit about your shield. <laughs> Fuck that shield. What's this shield gonna do? Why don't you attack the... Wait. Why don't you attack whoever has the highest score to go for Legend again? Because I don't think I have good enough stuff to go for it. You can only actually kill what you have like a offense bolt against. You can't just simply hit everything. Works against Camillas, uh, yeah, kind of does. Your Camillas AD went three times three against me. Soup, <laughs> that's what it's supposed to do. Do you need legend? No, I don't need legend. I do not need no legends. 22 guts, but it's not a must or a need. This thing's swift. Even if it is swift, I would outspeed it. Mm. 
Yeah, it is actually swift. Uh-huh, and I'll give a shot. This works against Camillas while uh, here you see the result. <laughs> Camillas evaporated. this with it like even if it goes wrong it's not really gonna go that wrong HP, mine, yeah, kinda. That's normal. Oh, not too many hits on this. Not good enough. Too much time left. Mm, not sure if this team is good enough for 30 seconds. I don't think so. No, I'm not liking that. Mm, well, I might, I might. Kinda depends if I'm one shot it. One shot. Uh, that was the furthest from a one shot. No! Four seconds, nope, too late. That was actually a full, full tank one with reduction on win. Well, that is most likely team one! Did Dream get two? Or uh, not G1, Legends, look. Ooh, yes, the Talisman. Talisman offense, probably. But team 1, once again. It's nice. Did I get a hit at the final thing? Wait, what did... What was your defense? Yeah, not surprised. <laughs> Fucking double Camilla still strong, man. Okay, let's check some of the offenses that I used. Didn't use this all too much, but Nefties in this case was the double fighter plus broken on 15 crit rate. Additional damage both sides. Um, Rogan I only used once, but just this set, the Rogan set. Damage on water because of Camillas. Uh, this thing was a 210 in this case, on the grass. The typical sets. Um, this team already showed this, already showed this. Amber was 15 critter also. Look at that. If this was like 1999, would be so nice, right? That would actually be 
freaking horrendously nice. But it has like 15 additional damage from attack in here, plus that. And then this is a little bit of everything. And then also 15 to great. Uh, I'll show Sonya's the worst. So for this thing, I'm not gonna show the pure vanilla. Uh, this thing was just, it was actually double fight shield. Because the shield was actually very useful against Amdoids. I didn't really plan it against Amdoids. But it was actually a very nice addition into Amdoids. Uh, the Sonyas were 180 on, well, Swift Broken, with attack increasing effect and attack increasing effect. And the other Sonya was also 180 with Swift Broken, and then also attack increasing effect and attack increasing effect and S2 damage. So that's kind of how those things roll. You just need about like 180 with like the speed buff. Show my Camillas. I can show Camilla. This is one Camilla. It's tanky as fuck with 153. And then the other Camilla. It's tanky as fuck with 104. This one actually has a nice annoying one over here as well. Look at that. 20 fucking 4. <laughs> this is just pure toxic, man. Oh yeah, I also heal for fucking I don't know how much. But I did really love this Sonya offense. This Sonya offense was really insane. Like, I'm definitely gonna be using that again and probably making this thing faster while I'm comfortable outspeeding more stuff. Because in this case, this had like my 4th or 5th best swift runes or so. Time to climb RTM. No, I'm actually gonna do RTM for someone else. Oh wait, I didn't record the session. Well, I just take it from the vault. It's fine. Where did we end up? Team 1! How about you, Scribble? I saw you were rushing as well. 